So I'm there, yeah, I'm on the beach, but I got a college education. I've grown up in an artist colony. I've been a surfer and a surfboard maker, and I've worked in plastics and composite materials. And I'm very familiar with materials and have become familiar with a particular material and have it in my garage that could be used. And have had it in my garage for months and have tried to make something else that has failed from it. So I backed off and made with a hot knife, and, I mean a hot, uh, yeah, with an electric carving knife and a hot iron and a copy of the Honolulu Advertiser. I made the first boogie ball. And I didn't know what to call it. I called it a snake machine for a while. Side, navel, arm, knee, and elbow. Acronym. Yeah. Yeah. Tried that name out. That was not a very popular name. I was going to work that name in with Mori and Mori Eel because the materials are like eel. So I went in my closet and uh, I sat and I, I came up with uh, the word. So I, this is the language I came up with. No. no. The name Boogie revealed itself. Came to you know. You talk about people talk about revelations. Well, I have revelations. We all have revelations.